Welcome to my local lake. It's uh, a really beautiful day. There's great light. And I'm just starting to take a walk around this lake and I'm going to see what I can get. There's a lot of diversity in the, in the bird life here and it changes seasonally as well. Over winter, um, I had some great sightings of herons, grey herons, and uh, we even had some egrets. Had a couple of invasive species such as uh, Egyptian geese and mandarin ducks. But you also get robins, chaffinch, great tits and blue tits. They're much more difficult to photograph because they tend to move super quick. And when you're on foot, very, very difficult to capture them. You really need a specialist hide to be able to get those smaller birds. I'm on a specific mission because there's a grebe. Despite having come down to this lake many times over winter and the beginning of spring, this is the first time I've seen a grebe. And it's actually the first time I've photographed it. The issue I have right now is that there are many coots that are nesting around the bank and they become super aggressive. They're kind of strange birds anyway because they tend to be a little bit schizophrenic and chase after each other anyway. But in nesting season they become even more aggressive and uh, this poor grebe has been confined to the centre of the lake. Um, he's still too far away to fill the frame. So this is like the third day I've been down to the lake trying to get this image and uh, I decided to try and uh, anticipate a little bit and go around the other side of the lake and see if, uh, if I can actually get a shot. As I'm looking out the lake, I've spotted him. He's actually moved further down. They're incredible birds. They duck dive. And if you watch ducks duck dive, they typically come up at the same place. These things. They can travel 10, 15 meters before they come up. So you have to really keep your eyes on the surface of the water. But I'm hoping, hoping that I can get close to him or at least he can get close to me. He's still right in the middle of the lake and he's surrounded by three tufted ducks and one coot. So I don't think he's gonna come close anytime soon. But I'm gonna see if I can get ahead of him and we'll see if we can get the shot. Right, okay, so I've got my grebe. I'm really happy. And I'm actually just filming some 4K footage of him. He's a stunning bird. He moves really quick. They actually uh, go a lot quicker than the other birds I've seen on this lake. I had to get some 4K video clips, which I'm really happy with, and a couple of stills as well. And I've had to work extremely quickly. Um, obviously, when I shoot stills, I shoot handheld for the flexibility. But when you go to 4K video, I have to quickly set up my tripod over here. And I keep it very low so I don't uh, create too much of a fuss and scare the birds off. Um, yeah, so working quickly, I got the shot. Pretty much walked around most of the lake right now and um, I've looked in two or three of the the nests 
and I haven't seen any chicks. So I'm going to check a couple more because it would be really, really cool if I could get some images of a few coot chicks. So um, I'm right down at the water's edge, in fact uh, there's a little bit of a foothold I can put, put my foot on here and just stretch out. Um, yes, I'm just watching them. Mum and Dad are pretty protective. They've already had one uh, other coot come over into their territory and there was a little bit of a, a, a fight going on. They're taking shelter under a low-hanging uh, tree, so that's uh, making things a little bit difficult. But um, this is where it's a waiting game, just hoping that uh, they pop out and you can get that shot. Um, but yeah, it just seems constantly as if they're feeding all the time, which is just incredible to watch. Well, I hope today's video has shown that you don't have to go to far-flung places to shoot great wildlife photography. If you can become a great photographer at your local lake with your local wildlife, then the day that you get a chance to go and see the bigger stuff, you'll be in great shape.